Hello and welcome again, traveler. Today we will be looking at all the different locations you can build up your supply of oil. Used for crafting, modifying, and painting certain weapons, armor, and power armor, it can be one of the more difficult resources to hunt down. So where do you find oil? First off, there's the best option for an ongoing supply, deposits. There are 20 located all over the map. Two in Toxic Valley, two in the forest, three in Cranberry Bog, four in the mire, and nine along the Savage Divide. You're able to build on these locations and have an ongoing source of oil, but each area comes with its own dangers. Again, I highly recommend fo76map.com to help you locate the deposits and see if this option works for you. Next, we have workshops, and there are six of them that have oil. Abandoned Bog Town in the northeast of the Cranberry Bog with one. Beckley Mine Exhibit in the southwest corner of the Ash Heap with three. Converted Munitions Factory at the very top of the Savage Divide with one. Federal Disposal Field HZ21 at the bottom of the Savage Divide with one. Grafton Steel Yard at the far east edge of the Toxic Valley with one. And Wade Airport just at the bottom of the forest before Charleston with three. Once you take them over, you'll have control of the deposit as long as you're in the game. But they will need to be defended from creatures, and sometimes other players. You'll also have to remember to collect the oil as you go. Then we have junk. There are 26 different junk items that produce oil, but I broke them down into 11 types to make it a little easier to remember. Blow torches, canisters, cooking oil, cutting fluid, flip lighters, fuel tanks, industrial size shortening, lanterns, oil cans, paint cans, and soap. I was actually able to find a ton of oil producing junk while exploring, but there were larger amounts in train yards, mines, kitchens, and bathrooms. Lastly, we have creatures. Right now, there are only three creatures that drop oil items. Floater flamers. Grafton monsters. And mothmen. Unfortunately, there aren't events that spawn large amounts of these creatures, so be sure to keep an eye out when you're exploring. That's all I have for today, Traveler. I hope this video has given you some useful information to help you find all the oil you'll need. If you have any helpful hints on places to farm oil or have a suggestion for the next video, please comment below. Also, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel so you'll know when the next video goes live. Have a great day and see you in the wasteland.